materials required to make DIY digital direct ophthalmoscope. Direct ophthalmoscope 5 mm cardboard sheet, 2 mm cardboard sheet, scale, pencil, marker, eraser, magnets, magnets you can buy it from Amazon, rubber bands, double sided tape, single sided tape, this could be surgical tape or scotch tape, cutter, scissors, Android or iPhone. First, I'll remove the head from the base. I'll take 5mm cardboard. For this, I'll use iPhone. For iPhone, I'll keep the device at the edge, almost 1.5 cm from the edge. Now, here, make sure this particular line is aligned with the bottom of the cardboard. Don't go over it or under it. Now, I shall draw out the boundaries. From the top, from the top, I shall take 5 cm and mark it here and from the edge, I shall mark it for 9 cm. Now I connect it through lines. Now I'll take a cutter and cut these lines and this part. Now we have this cut out. Next is with 2 mm sheet, I draw a line. I'll keep the iPhone one centimeter apart. As you can see, it's one centimeter. Now I'll mark out the phone on this cardboard. Now I'll mark the I'll mark the lines where the buttons are. As you can see, in this side we have it here, and on this side we have it over there. And now, I, I can take it out and mark the boundaries. On top, we'll need 1.5 cm height. I'll mark it here. On the other side, we have 1 cm and I'll mark it. And at the bottom, it's 1 cm again. So after marking all the sides, I'll mark it these lines again. We need to take out these parts. Now we can see the cutout. For the iPhone, the camera is on top right part. So we need to make a cutout over here so that it can be aligned with the lens of the ophthalmoscope. So I shall take the cutout that we did before and mark these two particular lines. This line and, and that line. But for that we shall take the phone out and now make the two lines. We should cut this particular area out. I'll cut out the edges over here so that it can be bended. Now I'll make a small cut, not completely through, just halfway down so that we can bend it easily. Keep, keep scale over here and then bend it like so. Now we place back the phone again and then we use the rubber band and place it like so. Now you have a phone holder. Now we have this and, and this cutout. We align it together where the camera should go to the cutout and sit like this. Now we mark the outline. 
Now that we have this line, we should mark the cutout lines for the magnet, which should come somewhere here. So here I have these magnets. I shall keep these two magnets somewhere equal from both the edges of the foam. I won't go completely through it. I'll just go halfway through it so that we can take out the uh, cutout, not completely cutting down the base. So that we can place the magnets with this double sided stick. Now I have two pairs of magnets. On Now I take out the uh, double sided tape from one end and place it inside. The next step is to stick the top part of direct ophthalmoscope in this way. Please note that the side wherein the magnets are, are supposed to be aligned with the back face of the top part of direct ophthalmoscope. I shall use the double sided tape here, stick it to the three face of the top part of direct ophthalmoscope and integrate it like so. It's important to align the faces as shown. For more security, I shall use surgical tape and stick it around. Please make sure to not cover the lenses. Now we have two cutouts. The alignment should come like this. Before we take the double sided tape off the other end, we have to align the camera and the lens. I shall open the camera app and align it exactly. This is how it should be. After aligning it, Please take out the other end of the double sided tape and place the camera cover on top. As you can see, I shall first align the camera and then firmly stick it to the cardboard sheet. Now after pressing it enough, I take it out and I can see that the magnets are being placed on the other end. You should be now able to see digital display of the direct ophthalmoscope lens. Now you can see whatever is visible down here is visible on the screen. You can take pictures, zoom in or zoom out. Now I shall place it back. Now we have DIY digital direct ophthalmoscope which is detachable. Now you can see DIY digital direct ophthalmoscope being used on a patient.